हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू क्विक कोड अकेडमी सो टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट द फ्रेम सेट कॉन्सेप्ट इन एच टी एम एल सो फॉर दैट वी विल हैव टू क्रिएट वन एच टी एम एल फाइल फर्स्ट सो करंटली आई मीन विजुअल स्टूडियो कोड सो लेट्स क्रिएट वन एच टी एम एल फाइल सो फॉर दैट यू कैन यूज द एच टी एम एल टैग लाइक दिस or there is one more method if you are using vs code so just enter shift then exclamation mark and click on tab so uh, it will create a um, poiler plate of html so uh, to learn this uh, frame set concept so actually we don't need this uh, body tag so we can remove this we just need the html uh, section so if you want you can keep this head section otherwise this is also not needed so there are uh, two types in which frame set can be used so frame set is generally used to uh, divide the uh, web page into uh, different uh, parts so if you want to divide the web document into horizontal parts then you can make use of rows and if you have to divide the document in the vertical parts then you can use the frame set calls so first we will look how to create the frame set so now you can type frame set can add rows and here you have to give specify the percentage in which you have to separate the document so now if i have to create uh, the frame set for horizontal partition then i can mention this frame set as 30 40 and then it should be always equal to 100% so now i will give one more partition as 30% so this is how uh, we create frame set of rows so in that you will have to add the frames inside the frame set so i have already have one code snippet for that so here if you see i am using this frame set and i am partitioning the document so let's make it as a row in the horizontal format and since i have a uh, partition the document in the three section so here i will have to use three frames and as of now i have taken the images as source file so let's run this program let's save this so now if you see since i have used this row attribute and that is why the first frame is of 50% and then the next frame is of 30% uh, 10% which is in red color and the last frame is of 40% so this is the horizontal partition i have done so now suppose if you have to uh, divide the document into vertical formats so then instead of rows you should replace it with calls and let's save this let's refresh so now if you see the first frame is of 50% in the vertical partition then the next frame is in 10% likewise 40% so now suppose if you want to change this properties so you can make it 30% and 30 plus 10 is 40 so to make it 100 we will have to give 60% so now save this one and now if i click on refresh so now if you see the first frame is 30% the next is 10% and the last one is 60% suppose uh you don't want to calculate the 
last frame size uh, manually so in that case you can give the star attribute which will calculate the percentage on behalf of you so let's save it so now if you see this is automatically 60% so now let's tweak some parameters so now if I give this 40 then 50 then now let's make it 40 and now if we save this one and click on the refresh then you can see the yellow color the last partition is automatically became 10% okay and similarly it works for the rows as well so as of now to show you in this example I have given the source as the images but here you can also give the external HTML files and those will be automatically get reflected over here so that's it as part of frameset I hope you like this video please like share and subscribe thank you